guys how are you i hope you're okay um so as you've seen in them part videos we have three pieces all together for the usb usb tattered lace um volume four shaped fork cards um we're on number three and three even and that's the baby cradle um so as you see i've got on my two back bits which is not going to work because i didn't even realize um i didn't flip it around so my two cradles are going to face the same way and one side will be blank and one will be like that you get my drift um so that was a fail on my part you really should flip it or use plain card stock, card, card stock. Um, and then you saw me cut out an extra piece in a different fabric and that's because um, obviously we have our little cradle that's going to be a swinging feature hopefully. You have our extra bit that we're going to use for detailing on the, the front of the cradle. So I'm going to cut this bit off so that we can detail, have a little bit of a trim. And then you have your standing bit, your Constantina fold, which I do believe goes like this. You literally just fold it together. And we're just going to glue it together and see what we do, how we go. Again, next time, either use plain cardstock or flip it around. But you do need three pieces of the cradle in total. So, I'm going to glue mine. I think it goes here. I have downloaded the USB um, um, tutorial to step by step whatever you want to call it I have downloaded it um, and I'm also going to be sharing this on my blog if you haven't already go check it out so hopefully it will stand it doesn't stand what have I done wrong there we go I'm not quite sure what I've done wrong so you get this little bit Again, we're doing this together, guys, because practice makes perfect. I do believe this bit hooks into here. Like so. Cute. Ooh. Sorry for being quiet. Trying to do this. I've never done this before. So I'm hoping for the best. And that keeps popping out, which is like common sense is going to. Just because... Okay, so what I'm going to do, I'm actually, I don't know whether how you're actually supposed to do it, it just says attach it all together. So I'm going to put it through the first loop, put a bit of glue on it, like so, and then glue this one on to attach it in place, like so. Oh, and that's so cute, it actually stands. Okay, so I'm going to take you off the stand so that you can see. Um... Actually, first, no, we're not. We're going to attach these bits. So I've got my scissors somewhere. I always do this. Why am I never prepared? Okay, I've got my scissors. And I'm just going to cut along these score bits. Super duper easy. It's already got like little grooves in there where, you, where it's got the detailing from the embossing. You can just cut it like so and then I would like just this railing bit here so you, these are totally personalizable totally totally and super duper cute as well guys again this is my first time making this card so I don't know whether it's going to be it's not going to be perfect you know not going to be perfect by all means um, but it'd be cute so I'm just going to, hopefully you can see, I'm just going to put a bit of glue, like so, and then, sorry if you can see my, attach it. So I made this one a little bit smaller so that I had that border and I knew where to put it, which is cute. Um, anything else? I think I might. Cut the bottom off and then glue the bottom on as well. I may have chosen too many contrasting patterns, um, which is okay, but maybe if you did plain cardstock and then pattern, it might work out a little bit better for you. 
again my first time making it so I'm just going with the flow <laughs> I'm just gonna line it up as best I can like so yeah that's gonna go like that okay I haven't quite lined that up correctly um, but it's already drying so that's a shame but okay done and that's that done so I'm going to take you off the stand so you can see what it actually looks like I'm going to try and get it to stand for you guys there we go hang on a minute guys I'll just see you in a minute how adorable is this look oh my god that's so cute thank you guys for watching I hope you enjoyed this video this one is probably by far my favorite if you haven't already seen the strawberry and the echo dark start art deco stopper go ahead check that video out um but thank you guys for tuning in and i'll see you next time